knowing mechanics, how your character works, and other tactics in the game is a great start to learning Smash. However, if you want to improve, there's a lot more to do. So here's a step-by-step -step plan on how to become a pro, or at least, what worked for me. Look for videos between your character and a character that's really good at countering them. See how this pro gets out of the situation without um, losing much percent. But more importantly, look for how pros get into an advantage or get out of disadvantage or secure a kill in advantage. Put them in a position where they do lose a stock. Smash is a game of anticipation. You want to see when your opponent will make a move, and you want to make sure that they can't see the same for you. So in any common situation in a fight, you need to make sure that you're using the most random moves possible. On the ledge, you should be doing trick outs and delays like that, and noting whether or not you have a double jump left so that you can do larger move ranges. Also, when learning moves just for fights, you should make sure to go one by one. Learn a new move that's complex, but um, learn it by spamming it or using it much more often than you would normally. But make this very clear so it'll show weaknesses. Like if you spam this move, they'll counter it in this way. So now you can anticipate what they might do in reaction to that move. For Joker, there's a move where if you fast fall while using the neutral air, he attacks at the front when he lands which means if you're about to attack someone, you can be very high above them and swing down and hit them, which can be a very effective uh, mix-up when fighting. Go into training and practice some combos. See which ones work best for you and which lead into other moves. Find what moves can be used when and where what kind of combos they would lead into. Don't use combos as a script but still use them as a track that you can lead one move and see where it goes from there. Practice against CPUs to learn your combos better and learn DI and teching. Focus when you crash to see how you make mistakes when doing these. However, also keep in note that you should be playing against real players to know what other playstyles you could be facing and how to escape other moves. It's best to do these player on player fights with people that are better than you, so that you may learn how to overcome better tactics. And most of all, have fun when playing the game, otherwise you won't be confident in yourself and you'll feel that you're doing everything wrong or not be improving at all. So have fun in any way possible.